Okay. Okay, 30 levels, finally. Um, here, let's get rid of all these zombies. So, hey guys, welcome back to another video, and, uh, I have a new skin today. So, I made a new skin, and I tried to make it actually look like me, but the flaws that are in it are, uh, one, it looks really pale. Like, like I, I look like I'm, like, super pale, which I'm not, because I couldn't really find, like, a good skin color. Either it was too yellow, and I looked like I was made of cheese, or it was, like, this. So, I just went with this, because I didn't really want to look like I was made of cheese. Also, this is kind of loud. Here, let's turn this down. But yeah, so this is this is me now, and this is what I look like with armor on. And we're at the zombie farm, and uh, I made an enchantment setup and stuff like that. So we have all this stuff here. But yeah, so basically why we're here is because I want to try to get like really good armor and stuff. Because like our armor right now is pretty good, but it's not like great. Like it's not like the perfect armor. And I really want to get like the perfect armor. And netherite, I don't really know because. If you have watched for a decent a while, we went to the nether one time and we went to a basalt biome because like, or like the, our nether portal spawned us in a basalt biome. So there's no, like it's really hard to like mine for netherite down there because I can't insta mine it, which is the main reason why I haven't gotten netherite. But also, I just haven't really like have the need to because like th this diamond stuff is fine, but um, I might get netherite soon-ish. I mean, it's already episode 29. So yeah, but anyway. So, finally, uh, enough talking, let's do some enchanting. I will actually- here, okay. So, I want to get this protection 3 to add to this. Right here. And, so, we're gonna add this protection 3. So, then this helmet has protection 4. And also, I want to rename this, because I don't know why I called it that. Um, plus one minute while they're breathing. I guess because of the respiration, but it's still kind of a bad name. So, I want to call these- Okay, I kind of thought of a cool name for when we make this netherite, because it doesn't look like it right now. But, uh, so I, yeah, I thought of a cool name, uh, Beskar Helmet. And the reason, if you don't know what Beskar is, um, from the Mandalorian, or just from the Star Wars universe, Beskar is what the Mandalorian's helmets are made out of, um, and, well, and their armor too. But the most famous thing is their helmet, uh, which is why I want to name this Beskar Helmet. And when it, like, they're, obviously the Mandalorian's helmets are, like, gray, kind of, um, or, like, shiny gray metal Beskar, basically. And when I turn this to netherite, it'll kind of look more like that. So I think that's actually a pretty good name. So I'm going to name it that. And uh, there we go. So, oh yeah. And I, I also got aqua affinity, which I want to put on there too. So I actually, I actually don't know, like a respiration and aqua affinity, they're both ocean related, but I actually don't know. Like, I forget which one does what. I think the respiration does water breathing because I named my helmet that. So I guess aqua affinity just lets you see better and pro I guess mine better too, maybe, but I'm not for sure. But I, I think that's worth it. Okay, so now we have a really good helmet, and I still need to get a better chest plate, and I have fire protection on my boots, which isn't great. I don't know, maybe... I don't know, I don't really want to, like, re... Like, 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 make new boots. That, that'll probably be, like, a later project, but... Like, I need to get, like, efficiency 5 on this. Like, I, I just want to get, like like the perfect tools and i'm not gonna get efficiency five on my shovel because um if you guys don't know it's actually literally pointless to do that and they they got rid of like the like like they they toned down the enchantment glint a lot like you guys can tell like on my armor like if you have to kind of look closely to even tell that it's enchanted honestly i don't really know if i like i think it's actually kind of cool because like it looks like i have normal diamond armor until you like finally see the enchantment glint and you're like oh but at the same time it's like harder to tell now so I don't know okay so i kind of want to make a new chest plate because this one has thorns on it which i don't really like and also it only has protection three so uh let's make let's make a new chest plate and i want to go see what enchantment i can get on this uh fire ew okay that's lame uh okay i'm gonna go back to the zombie farm now okay so i saw protection four right here and we have 30 levels so hopefully i get i'm breaking through two but i don't know yes okay perfect now uh, i don't need this anymore so now all we really need to do to get like full prop four is just uh get new boots which i probably should i'll probably do because i like today i i don't really know what, what else i want to do but i want to try to get like really good stuff so i guess back to the house we go Okay, so I saw Fire Aspect 2 for my, my sword, because I actually don't have that. So, I'm going to put this on my sword. I also want to rename my sword, too, because, like, I want to give them, like, actual names. You know what? I'm going to keep with the Star Wars theme, and I'm going to call it Lightsaber. 
I think that's how you spell it, right? Hopefully. Actually, here, you know what? Let's let's uh let's make sure. How do you spell lightsaber? Lightsaber. L I G H T S A B E R. Alright, okay, I spelled it right. Good. Okay. Thanks, Siri. <laughs> okay, so here we go. Yeah, okay, now I can actually kill mobs with fire. Amazing. Oh yeah, and then I also have I was trying to get these boots to have good like a uh, prot four. Let's see. So usually what I do is I just basically look for protection four or whatever enchantment I want. And if I don't get it, like I'm breaking three, I just enchant a book with level one and then eventually disenchant it later. Uh oh, prot four, okay. Yeah, so protection four. So now basically what I do is I just put these all in the grindstone here and i want to keep this aqua affinity one and then i just basically fk here basically uh for like a little bit kill zombies because obviously there's mob cramming so i can't just like wait forever and get like 500 zombies there and I, i'm watching a video and then if every once in a while i just come over here and do this kill all of them ow they can hit me through that i did not know that and yeah and then i just go back here until i get level 30 so that's basically how i've been how i've been doing this in case you're interested so yeah so let's get this and hopefully it should be i mean it, it, there's no guarantee but hopefully it's has mo more enchantments on it okay that's pretty good actually i'm probably not gonna wear these i'm gonna probably just i guess wear these but i i think in the next just a couple episodes i want to try to get the perfect armor and that might include getting netherite but anyway uh we've <laughs> we've definitely done enough enchanting for this episode so now we're gonna go do something else Okay, so what I want to do now, um, kind of still involves gear, but not really. So basically, I already have three netherite scraps, and uh, I want to make like all my stuff netherite eventually, obviously. But I only have three right now, and I want to try to get as much as I can today. And the reason I don't have that many is because when we spawn in, spawned in the nether, uh, like I said earlier, we spawned in a basalt delta which is like really hard for netherite mining so what i want to do is kind of go far away and make a portal and hopefully spawn in a different biome i don't really know how far away i want to go because eight blocks in the overall there's only one in the nether so i probably have to go pretty far away but hopefully we can spawn in another biome and go netherite mining there this seems like a good spot this is my where i get all the spruce wood and also yes i too lazy to cut off all the tops of these trees so i'm going to make another portal and yes i'm gonna put the corners on it you can judge me all you want but i like doing that look at how much better that looks <laughs> okay let's go I'm, i have my sword ready though in case Ugh, really okay well i guess we have to go farther um okay uh i basically i went probably yeah, like a couple hundred more blocks, so hopefully this is a better spot. Okay, let's see. I think it's a thunderstorm. Kind of looks like a thunderstorm. Really? Wait, is, isn't this the same portal? This is literally the same portal, come on. Okay, so we're at the village, and I actually kind of <laughs> kind of forgot about all the projects that we had planned here. But anyway, um, this is about... 500 or more like 600 blocks away from home so hopefully this will actually and also it's in the opposite direction too um so hopefully this will get us somewhere else so i guess let's find out oh, really i guess let's just kind of go look oh look we're like right next to the uh, the nether fortress oh that actually might be a different one i don't know maybe i'll just go really far this way and then uh, just pray that we actually can find another wastes. So I was out here. I'm about 1300 blocks away from zero zero. So that's about 1100 blocks away from home. And I found this. So I actually don't know if I found this before. I don't think I have, right? Yeah. Uh, I don't know. Is there a room? Oh, I got scammed. Okay, that's kind of sad. Let's see. I'll use this bed to sleep. Ooh, look at this. Wait, have we seen this before? I don't. I don't know if we have. Okay, let's see. 18 yeah so we haven't been here and we can actually collect the ice which is pretty cool um i won't do that now but uh if for future me there's the coordinates let's see okay i think this is probably a good spot to make a new portal hopefully lead us to not a stupid basalt delta 
Oh my. Oh, wait. <gasps> yes. <laughs> so it's like I knew it. Um, it looks like this is kind of like an enclosed cave thing, which is kind of cool. And yeah, so we're just going to go mining for some netherite. Pretty much probably until this is close to breaking, which hopefully we'll get something out of this. Ooh, look at what we have. Okay, I was just mining out some quartz. Oh, it's multiple. That's nice. Okay, so two. I'm assuming it's just two. Now we can officially make at least one nether ingot, but I want to try to make a couple. Okay, I've been mining for a while here. You can see all this nether hack that I dug out, but we finally got another piece. It might be more. Yeah, it's more than one. Ooh, it's three. Okay, so brings our total up to five plus three is eight. So now we can make two ingots, which is really nice. Um, I think this method is a lot better, like doing it like this instead of just strip mining. Yeah, I think this method is a lot better because I haven't even been mining for that that much longer and I already found another piece. Okay, so I didn't really actually find any more, but I think now we're going to go, where is it? Here we go. Oh, uh, <laughs> uh, we're gonna go back up to the surface and get our netherite ingots so then we can make our stuff into netherite and part of the reason i'm trying to get netherite now is because if you guys don't know in 1.20 they're adding the netherite upgrade thing instead of just um using ingots which i don't really like because like i don't want to go to a bunch of bastions just to find some netherite so i'm trying to get all my netherite stuff before uh that update comes out and i'll probably not update like, if I don't end up doing that, then I probably won't update to 1.20, um, unless I'm, uh, going to, but, uh, yeah, okay, so this is the coordinates of this portal right here, um, for future me. Here, I'll just take a screenshot as well. Actually, probably take a screenshot like that. There we go. Okay, so, yeah, I'm gonna head back home. I think it was this way, right? Yeah, it's this way. So, yeah, I'll see you back home. Okay, so we're back at the house, and let's make our first netherite ingots. Okay, here we go. Yeah, okay, perfect. Now, uh, I made a smithing table. I don't know where to put it, though. I guess I'll put it right here. Why not? So, the two things that I want to make into netherite, I think one of them will be my pickaxe. Actually, you know what? Before I do that, I want to repair this. Perfect. Now we can go make Rob into netherite. Yes. Okay. Our first piece of netherite gear. Look at how amazing it looks. Oh my god. Okay. And uh, the second thing that I want to make into netherite is probably uh, I might make my axe netherite, but like, the same with that. I need to repair it first. Okay. Let's repair my axe. Okay, cool. So we have a netherite pickaxe and a netherite axe. That's pretty nice. So yeah, I think that's going to be the end of this video because we did a lot of stuff today. Well, it, feel, it feels like I did because <laughs> because um, I've been recording this episode over the past couple days. I know we actually, we didn't really do the mu that much today, but yeah, I still think I want to end it. So thanks for watching and... I will see you in the next time. In, yeah, in the next time. <laughs> okay, bye.